Hey guys, this morning we'll be looking at multiplying fractions. But before we go any further, let us answer this riddle. If two is a company and three is a crowd, what is four and five? Think about it. All right, let's get into the lesson. <clears throat> Nine times seven over 10. Nine here is a whole number. A whole number understood as a fraction with a denominator of one. Now, the first thing we do when we are multiplying fractions, we check for cancellation. We can cancel diagonally, vertically, but never horizontally. All right, so after our check, we realize that we can't cancel, so we multiply across. Nine times seven will give us 63. One times 10 will give us 10. Now, 63 over 10 is a, an improper fraction. So we need to write that improper fraction as a mixed fraction or a mixed number. And always write your fraction in its lowest term. So we have 10 into 63 goes 6 times 3 over 10. And that's our final answer. Now let's look at that one. 6 over 8 times 3 over 12. Again, we check for cancellation. We can cancel here 3 and 12. We can cancel here 6 and 8. We can cancel here 6 and 12. All right? But we can't cancel 8 and 12, nor 6 and 3. Never horizontally. All right? So whichever one you want to choose, your answer will be the same. All right? So I'll go with 6 and 12. 6 and 12, 1. 6 and 12, 2. Then we multiply across. 3 times 1. 3. 8 times 2. 16 and that's our final answer all right now let's look at this one 3 and 2 over 8 times 9 over 10 so we go we change this mixed fraction to an improper fraction 8 times 3 that's 24 plus 2 will give us 26 over 8 times 9 over 10 then we check for cancellation we can cancel, 2 into 26 goes 13, 2 into 10 goes 5. Then we multiply across. So 13 times 9. Now for mental calculation, we just add 1 to that and make it 10. So 10 times 13 will give us 130. Then we subtract 13 will get 117 over 8 times 5 will give us 40. All right, that's an improper fraction, so we need to write that as a mixed fraction. So 40 into 117 goes 2 times, that's a whole number, and uh, remainder 37 over. 40. All right, and that's our final answer. Let's look at this one real quick. Here we have a mixed fraction, so we're going to turn it into a, an improper fraction. 6, 3 is 18 and 5, 23 over 6 times 2, 2 is 4 and 1, 5. So that's 5 over Two. All right, we check for cancellation. <clears throat> we can't cancel, so therefore we multiply across. Five, three is 15. Carry on, five, two is 10, and one, 11. Six, two is 12. Now we find out how many times can 12 go into 115 and if your answer is nine times then you are correct so nine whole number and how much remainder the remainder is seven over 12 and that's our final answer 
All right, guys, so that's it on multiplying fractions. Here we look at with a whole number, just two proper fractions, a mixed and a proper, and two mixed. All right.